It's a, it's a local family-owned restaurant we wanted to share with you at the top of this show because it's been in the Valley for some 63 years. Troy Green with Miracle Mile Deli is sharing the best of their New York-style recipes in our Stone Creek kitchen today. It's good to see you. Thanks for having us. I hope you made it in safely, easily, and um, thanks for bringing along that tiny little tool over there for us. We're going to be using it a little Somebody bit. Somebody had some muscles to get that thing in here. It's here. That's all that matters. Uh, absolutely. So we're making a, a new, what do you call New it? Yorker. New Yorker. And you asked me, you know, just before we sure. um, were live on the air, and you said, have you ever eaten one? I said, I, no, I haven't. So what's the kind of the key components to this sort of sandwich? Our New Yorker sandwich is, is my favorite sandwich. And it's really a summary sandwich to where you're going to have pastrami. We're going to have coleslaw. Ooh. Uh, the coleslaw we're going to actually be making today. We're going to be slicing the pastrami today. Uh, and we're going to serve it on an onion roll. It can be served on any, any roll or any bread. But this is how we serve it. And we... We it looks it like well. you have a little secret ingredient over here, too. Does this go on this, or is this for something else? This is our Miracle Mile sauce, which is a thick Thousand Island or a Russian dressing. And does it go on all of them, all of the sandwiches, if you ask for it? If you ask for it, absolutely. Okay. On the New Yorker, it really, really brings everything together. Okay. Well, then, get me started on the primary ingredients of the coleslaw. You can put me to work, and then you can show everybody how this big contraption works. Absolutely. So what we've got here, we've got some uh, finely grated cabbage, just okay. green cabbage here. What we're going to be adding, we're just going to be adding... Just a little bit of carrots here. You're going to be tossing it. That's okay. Right. And then we're going to be adding a little bit of sweet red bells here. Okay, not too much, just for a little bit of color, a little bit of flavor. And then here we're just going to pour in. What is in, that? This is coleslaw dressing. Okay. Now this is one of our family recipes, and it can be really wet or it can be nice and dry, but we're going to make it wet. You're going to We're going to make stir sure it that all we, in there. we get a little messy when we eat this. Absolutely. All right. Well, I'll stir this up. It doesn't look like there's much more to it than just that. That's correct. And, and that's this is ultimately where it's going to end up looking That's something. what it should look okay. like. Absolutely. All right. Now, pastrami. Give me pastrami 101 because just to look at it, it looks like it's completely burned and it, there wouldn't be any goodness in it. It but. looks like a charred piece of meat, but actually it's, it's a beef product and it's a deli meat and it's a deli meat you don't see very often in, in the home. But it's something that uh, is very famous back east. Okay. Uh, it's a smoked meat. It comes from corned beef. So is it going to have uh, a bit of smoked. a salty flavor to it? It's going to have a very salty okay. flavor. Now, it's injected, but it's also tumbled in pepper mixture. And then, as you can see, it's got plenty of fat on it, so it's going to be very flavorful. All right. Okay. So this gets trimmed up, and all this fat comes off to make wow. it leaner. Okay. So we could do that, but we've already got that uh, already trimmed up on another piece right here. So we're going to slice it up and we're going to make Keep a my fingers out of the way. You don't want your fingers in here? No, I don't think okay. so. We'll get this here. Now, we'll make a is sandwich. there, what's the, the right ratio of kind of the, the, the thickness of this? this You're going to want one millimeter to two millimeters so you can actually get through it and get a nice, nice deli sandwich. Okay. Okay, so you're going to see it come off here. And it's going to come off with nice, lean pieces because this one is already trimmed. So it does have a little bit of the fat, which is the goodness, but you make it so thin that we don't struggle with it. We enjoy just that perfect Absolutely. combination in every bite. And pastrami can be chewy if it's cut, cut the wrong way or uh -huh. if it's, it's not trimmed well. This is going to be absolutely phenomenal. Do you cut it with, with like in, in the direction of the, I'm going to call it grain, but I don't know if that's the right way. Like well the, done. Is it, do you cut it in a certain direction? You cut it across the grain across so it's not chewy. Grain. Okay. Now. This is cut straight across the grain. That's plenty for us right now. And wow. we'll bring it back over here to where okay. you got your cool star. Are you ready? Yes, I think I did a fine job for you, Troy. Well done. Well done. Okay, so we got uh, all the main ingredients. So we're going to have our onion roll from Karsh's Bakery. And we're going to have our Russian dressing. Is We've that got local? Pastrami. Very local. Okay. They've been serving us for since the 50s. Okay, we'll long, get to how long, long you've been in town Perfect. because you guys are... Grab these real sure. quick. And, do you want uh, me to slather this on there? Or actually, does it... Why don't you put that on the top Okay, there. on the top. And you said have kind of have heavy, a heavy hand on this, right? Heavy hand, yeah, absolutely. Okay. Put it together because it's going to keep the sandwich together once we get it. Now we're talking anywhere from a third of a pound to even more than that for a sandwich. This oh, my gosh. This is going to be a hearty sandwich. <laughs> you are joking be, about better that. Better be hungry. Okay, so then... We're going to we're gonna mound this up right, right on here? top of that. Yeah. Okay. Mound some more than that. Gotta you got to put me to work. Yes. If I don't get to work You're in the kitchen, I, I, I don't get paid as much as I would like to. Okay. Absolutely. How about that? Too much? Out of the way. That's Brendan, perfect. too much? Okay. More? <laughs> a little bit more? All right. This guy's so hungry every morning. Yep. I don't think they Slap feed him at home. You're doing a great job. <laughs> yes. Okay. <laughs> okay. The key to the sandwich is going to be messy, but who cares? Because you're at home during the summer. 
Slice into it sideways so we can see how that yep, looks. Yeah, we're going to cut it right down the center. We're going to open it up. Okay. When we come back, we're going to be making another uh, Miracle Mile Deli signature sandwich, the uh, the triple decker. Um, Brandon, here's your sandwich. It's ready to go. That's yours. It's got your name on it. I have completely earmarked that for you. But you have to continue to run the camera for the entire hour, and then you're rewarded. That's how we do here. Oh, if that's how it works. <laughs> right, right. Stick around because we're going to make that other sandwich coming up.